Okay. All right, guys. It's Saturday, and we found ourselves at Piedmont Park because there is an ice cream festival going on over here. So we're gonna get some ice cream and hopefully some other stuff. It's supposed to be like 85 plus restaurants out here from the Atlanta area, so we gonna see what they working with today. Right. So uh. Let's go eat. It's an alcohol alternative. In other words, there's no liquor in this. Spare alternative, flavorful artesian beverages, low sugar drink. So if you don't drink, this is for you. So I'm not gonna lie to you. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of choices. Mm -hmm. that we haven't even covered yet. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys saw, but like, there is a line of food trucks that are just like stacked back to back to each other. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's kind of difficult to make a decision actually, but I think we're gonna make our first decision on what we want to get. Right. Uh, so so some, some interesting notes I saw, the jerk chicken mm -hmm. or the the jerk, whatever it is, the Jamaican food. Mm -hmm. uh, Lytle, the store, mm -hmm. the supermarket, has a food truck. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. And apparently they're like, I think they're like the biggest host here mm -hmm. for this thing. I know there's like a bunch of hosts. Mm -hmm. uh, and they have a food truck. There was a gyro truck with some Italian sausage there. Mm -hmm. um, I think I may want to do that, but I'm not really sure. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, there were various smoothie places and ice cream places and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, so it's just a matter of preference, what, you, what you're what you feeling like. Right. So let's go and get something to eat. I'm hungry. Yeah. So we found this spot called Lemonade Mixology. And when I hear Mixology, I mean, I don't think there's gonna be alcohol in it, but when I hear Mixology, I get curious. So we're gonna check out uh, what they got going on over here and get some lemonade.
what's your opinion on that ice cream? Not bad. Not bad at all. Mm -hmm. It took a while to get some ice cream at an ice cream festival, but I mean. <laughs> Alright guys, it was fun, but it's hot out here, we headed out, we got some good food, Yeah. we got some good drink, we got some good ice cream. What was the interesting, most interesting thing that you saw? Um, food wise, I should say food wise. Food wise? That's a good question, I have no idea. Um, there was a, there was a, even though I'm not vegan, they have vegan ice cream. That's something I personally don't see every day. a lot of vegan stuff, vegan yeah. related stuff. They had, uh, they had street corn that we didn't get on camera because we didn't see it until the last minute until we were leaving up out of here. Mm -hmm. um, and it, it looked good too. They, um, our ice cream, our cookies and cream ice cream, I'd say was a little unique. I'm used to, because it was homemade, I'm not used to seeing it look like chocolate ice cream. Right. But it was good. It was, it looked like chocolate ice cream, but it tastes just like cookies and cream. It was, it was delicious. I will say this in general about the food overall. Mm-hmm. Um, and maybe I was dumb for not expecting this, I guess, or whatever. Mm hmm But a lot of, a lot of the trucks and stands like they were giving out whole ass meals. This wasn't just like, you know, oh yeah, yeah something yeah. on a stick or whatever. Yeah, like, we talking about entire plate, like the jerk chicken place. Yeah, we were gonna go get some jerk chicken, like but then those? we saw someone with a plate, and I'm like, nah, I'm good. Nah. <laughs> and like, it was the same thing, and like, and it, and you know, it's not even just like the jerk chicken. Like they have barbecue there. Williams mm. Brothers barbecue was there. Uh, and they were giving out whole plates and to me like if I eat a whole plate of something I'm not gonna want to eat anything else it, exactly especially at an ice cream social and, and I'm more or less expecting a big event like that I want to be able to go around to a lot of places mm -hmm. and try out the food but mm -hmm. like if I go to that one truck and they giving out whole ass dinner plate <laughs> I'm done for the event <laughs> exactly but uh all in all it was it was a it was a nice experience i see why they do this every year mm -hmm. um but that'll do it for this episode of drink tales guys and uh until next time peace <laughs>